Ciao and welcome back to Couple Eats World. This hotel video is about the Grand Hotel Parkers, the first 5-star luxury hotel in Naples, Italy. Entering the hotel, you're welcomed by the most fabulous hotel lobby and friendly staff that make you feel at home right away with their openness. Here is a tour of the lobby which transmits wealthy cultural vibes. The details, the exhibition of art, the grand decor, including display jewelry, is setting the tone for utmost luxury. You are just left awestruck by all this grandiosity. George Parker, the marine biologist, purchased the hotel in the late 19th century. The hotel opened in 1870 and is a piece of timeless elegance and European grandeur situated in the most picturesque setting in Naples. The lobby and adjacent sitting area are just marvelous. Leading onto the grand ballroom, where celebrations must be exquisite, given the regal ambience. Look at these marble pillars and glamorous design. Can you see yourself twirling in your ball gown? Marble after marble adds to the opulent flair what else to be expected in Italy. Let's walk to the room for a room tour. The corridors are decked with mild yet regal decor. This is a beautiful room with elegant interior yet a clean design allowing for light and lightness which is perfect for the compact room. Now giving you a moment to absorb everything and let the impressions sink in. Chandelier, 
that is kept as a centerpiece of the bedroom. The bed was comfortable. Sorry for the slight blur there. These are the outlets available and you have space for personal stuff inside the bedside table drawers. Funky reading lamp! Such a nice functional gimmick that adds a futuristic touch to the classic room. On the working desk you can see the Naples map which we were given upon arrival by Marco, who was truly very charismatic and welcoming. Some space for your luggage. We traveled light on this occasion, which is always a bit easier. And here another quick view to the other bedside table and phone. The corridor is kept light and airy despite being narrow, so they cleverly tucked away the minibar and safe behind these imperial doors. You have the usual choices of gratis items such as coffee, tea, water, among some items that can be purchased. Next to it you will find the wardrobe. It isn't the largest but nonetheless useful to have. There is no ironing board and iron provided. We usually carry our handheld steam iron to freshen up our wardrobe on the go. But you can surely request an iron from the concierge desk. The bathroom has been renovated. There is a sliding door to the bathroom that comes with a large mirror facing the corridor side. The bathroom is in its entirety marble. They used light marble accented with some amber colored marble on the washing basin desk and along the flooring. They complimentary provide beautiful smelling toiletries from Floris, which are a British family perfumers. It would have been a nice touch to use an Italian brand local to the area, but we are definitely not complaining about these lovely luxury items. The walk-in shower is spacious and comes with Floris shampoo, conditioner and shower gel, which comes in an eco-friendly refill pack. The shower has a handheld and rain shower option. Next to the toilet, you will find a bidet, which is a good alternative to a bidet shower. They provide lush sleepers, which is not always common in more generic hotels in Europe. Final shots are serene views during nighttime. Good night and see you at breakfast.
Good morning, Naples. Wow, this view does not get old. One of the most fabulous scenic views from a hotel we have come across to date and we loved every bit of our morning and our fresco breakfast on the terrace. These views are just breathtaking. Leave a comment if you agree. The breakfast is predominantly a la carte, however, you by default serve with pastries including local specialities, bread, yogurt, small portion of fresh fruits and jam and then you can order a cheese platter which was delicious, one of the best ricotta and mozzarella we ate, as well as a selection of cold cuts, salmon, eggs made to order, pancakes and much more. Look at the artsy interpretation of avo on bread with a poached egg. Sorry for the spam, but this view is so captivating, we could not get enough of it. We hope you feel the same? Let us know in the comments. The breakfast setting really called for a slow morning, which we thoroughly enjoyed. Now some shots from our balcony view. It rained the second morning, but the sun came out and by lunchtime we were presented with sun-kissed views over the Bay of Naples and the lovely town. The hotel is located in the upmarket and artsy quarter of Chiaia and quite a walk away from the old city. But it is a great walk that lets you discover the smaller alleys and hidden areas one should experience for the quintessential Naples vibe. Here comes the gym and a peek outside at the back of the hotel. Returning through the gym to the spa section which was under renovation when we stayed there but the spa entrance has a nice ambience. We continue the tour onto the top floors where the restaurants are located. This is the area just outside of the lifts. Entering into the all day dining and breakfast restaurant Bitter, which also serves cocktails you are met with a very open space and panoramic views of Naples and its gulf. Spam alert! There are more shots coming of the most beautiful panorama.
has a two Michelin starred restaurant called George, which serves gourmet foods inspired by the Campania region. A chic yet modern interior. We didn't get a chance to try the restaurant, but this sure is perfect for special occasion and for food connoisseurs alike. The hotel also comes with a rooftop, an amazing place with far-reaching views of Naples, from Posilipo to Vesuvius, across the entire Gulf of Naples. Some of the local words and places most probably have been mispronounced, but we hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, show some love to the channel by liking and subscribing to Couple Eats World. Leave a comment and let us know what your favorite part in the video was. Thank you for your time. Ciao!